Hill, I come bearing gifts. Stark, I come bearing impatience. Fair enough. Truth is, we know where your favorite bone-faced turncoat is hiding out, and not even the word fortress accurately describes it. And if Taskmaster got any data from AIM before you rescued our agents, he's gonna be prepared for anything I might throw at him. Ding, ding, ding! Luckily, you've got the incomparable, unanticipatable Avengers on your side. Would you like me to pull up Agent Master's files? Wouldn't be any use. His photographic muscle memory means he's a new beast every time we meet him. Too bad. I was hoping for some embarrassing ID photos or questionable credit card purchases. I'm detecting an aim patrol in the area. Aw, oh, they missed me. Let's go say hi. Baddies are bad. Still say hello. We can take them. No problem. Does this are not friends anymore? Jarvis, find out if Taskmaster knows we're coming. You've got Master Kick. Certainly, sir. I have unfortunate news. Taskmaster knows we're coming. Correct. I always preferred making a grand entrance. This doesn't change anything. We're still going after them. Thank you, Stark. AIM's protecting their lieutenant with everything they've got. I told you Monica's a Taskmaster fangirl. Woo! transformation, so I wouldn't call us friends.
Going up and up and up. Sir, you and Commander Hill have a call. Patch it through. Commander Hill. Long time no see. Jarvis, hang up. Wait a m Connection ended. You know, that is way funnier when you're not the one getting hung up on. Hill, got any secret weaknesses you want to let us in on? Just do what you do best, Stark. Improvise. Don't stick to a plan and occasionally act outside of your own self-interest. Taskmaster won't know what hit him. reward to whomever brings me an Avenger's head. You sure know how to incentivize the troops. Did you learn nothing from me? Everything I needed to stop you. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, sorry. Did that hurt? That's all your shield training was. Are you questioning your master's judgment? Just his bleeding heart, which I've been reliably informed I don't have. Whoopsie. Here we go. Good of you to come. A shame you won't be around long. Glad we're on the same page about your chances. Wild guess? Those are the bad guys.
Thank you, Avengers. Go see Sarah Garza in the Resistance Bay. Look, something is going on. Anthony Masters is not immortal, and he's certainly not undead, whatever his costume might imply. That leaves cloning. And if they figure out how to clone a guy with a superpower, who knows what else AIM can do? Exactly. Thank you for taking Taskmaster out. In a way, it's vindication for A-Day, for everything he put us through at S.H.I.E.L.D. and after. I'm gonna hold on to that. Thank you, Avengers. Go see Sarah Garza in the Resistance base. Looks like this mystery is just starting to unfold. Mark Raxton, a junior executive at Allen Chemicals, turned himself in to authorities today, claiming that he was solely responsible for the company's involvement with AIM scientist Dr. Spencer Smythe. Smythe and Advanced Idea Mechanics are both under investigation after raw footage of advanced synthoid testing was leaked to the Daily Bugle's website, raising questions as to whether AIM's practices are not just unethical, but illegal. The Bugle's internal investigation into who uploaded the live stream is still underway. Hey, Liz. Are you okay? <sighs> sort of. Uh, still processing, I think. Mark always had a bit of a protective streak. I guess I'd never expected him to do all this just to save my career. I mean, working with AIM? Even knowing what they were really doing, it just... And you wouldn't have lost that internship in the first place if it wasn't for Peter Parker. Peter? Peter had the right idea this whole time. AIM is dangerous. We should have exposed them a lot sooner. So... you don't hate him? <laughs> I mean, I did it first. You know, nobody likes losing their job. But this is bigger than both of us. And now I have something to offer the Resistance. What's that? Maybe Allen Chemicals can't officially work with the Resistance, but they can at least spare one of their top biochemists. Me. <laughs> Parker said you were as tough as you are smart. He was right. So what about you, huh? What's next for Spider-Man? Well, first I'm gonna go back to New York and get a decent slice of pizza. <laughs> After that, I guess it's back to the old grind. Speaking of, I have work to do, so it's cool if you want to go, like, have some superhero bonding time or whatever. Oh, that's okay. I'm still not used to having people around. I've always flown solo. Or swung, I guess. So working with the Avengers has been... Kind of terrifying, but also nice? Uh, I don't know. It's strange. Having people want to be around me, and wanting to be around them, too. <laughs> That's called having friends, Spidey. You should try it sometime. I think you'll like it. You did good out there. 
Yeah? And you know, if you wanted to stick around on a more permanent basis, I don't think anyone would mind. Uh, Bruce only requested that you limit your lab time to once a day and during work hours. I... I'm really flattered. But I've still got my own messes to clean up back home. New York isn't gonna save itself. Still, if you need anything from me, give me a call. And I'll be there. Oh, yeah? You're not gonna go all, I work alone on us? <laughs> I guess it's not the worst thing in the world to have a couple of superhero friends on speed dial. Uh, actually, if you don't mind, could I get a lift back to New York? Kind of far for a ride share. Hey, Aunt May. Sorry I'm late. I was hanging out with some new friends. Hey, don't sound so surprised. You know what? I did have a nice time. But you know you're always my preferred company. Sure, I'll grab some tamales on the way home. Yeah, I'm glad I had a good day too. Love you. <laughs> 